I follow Rick Stroud, uh, who covers the Bucks uh, in Tampa. Um, he tweeted out Jameis Winston doing a PSA uh, with a, a doctor to try and raise money locally still. Um, and it just shows you how uh, his mindset is still focused on his own community and just being somebody who's out there in the community. And that I, I can only think that's also something that he wants to uh, show teams that I can do this for you too. Um, right. and, and again, uh, I'm sure his altruism comes from uh, every fiber of his being. That's what he has definitely shown in the last couple of years, if not maybe longer for those who know him a little bit better than me. I just bring that up too because – he and Cam Newton are still sitting out there. What in the world is happening with those two guys? And we all know the spots that could use them. We don't know if they're going to do that before the draft. What can you tell me here uh, now less than three weeks before the draft about those two guys? Rich, I don't think there's any hurry for teams with these guys because now the the frenetic stuff has stopped. Now that Nick Foles has gone to the Bears, uh, Phillip Rivers has gone to the Colts, Teddy Bridgewater, Tom Brady – uh, and I'm sure I'm missing one or two, but I think now it has become very clear that the New England Patriots might sign a veteran quarterback, might, but if they do, it'll be at their price tag and at their time. Um, I think now the two biggest teams that you really wonder about uh, is being in the market for both Cam and Jameis Winston uh, would be the Jacksonville Jaguars and the Los Angeles Chargers. But if I am either one of those teams, I wouldn't want to sign either one of those quarterbacks until after this draft. And, I, I mean, somebody asked me that this week, What do you the other day, what do you think is going to happen to those guys? And, 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 and here's the only reason I say that. Let's say that Dave Caldwell and Doug Marone of the Jacksonville Jaguars really like Justin Herbert, okay? And on draft day, Justin Herbert pulls an Aaron Rodgers. And there, the Jacksonville Jaguars sitting there with the 20th pick in the first round, the pick acquired, uh, you know, in the trade for Jalen Ramsey with the Los Angeles Rams. At number 20, what if Justin Herbert's sitting there? And what if they love him? And what if they say, geez, man, I wish we didn't sign – yeah. Jameis Winston, now we'd rather have Justin Herbert to draft and develop. So it doesn't make any sense for me, in my mind, um, you know, similarly, if the Chargers are sitting there at 37 or even at six, really, with Herbert or at 37, we'll say Jordan Love or, or Fromm or Eason, or maybe they love one of those guys. How do we know? And he's sitting there at 37, and they can pick their guy of the long-term future. So that's why... I'm not saying I don't think I'm not saying I absolutely don't think it'll happen, but I, I my my expectation is that both of those guys will probably find a home sometime in the spring. Um, and to me, Cam Newton, I would think he'd find a home sometime after a team could have its own doctors examining him and finding out exactly how his foot is and how his shoulder is. No, well, that's not going to be for some time, though. I mean, you're 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 talking maybe right. you know potentially the summer for something like that based on everything we read in headlines. Right. I agree, but but Rich, as you can see, we can see which way the wind is blowing on all of this stuff. Okay, and and in my opinion, I mean, I doubt that any team is going to have any sort of mini camp at all this year. Okay, right, and they will be fortunate to have any kind of training camp. I think. And if all that is the case, and I mean, I just, this is, this is, this is a tangible thing. It's not like they're being forced to make a decision tomorrow on Tua Tagovailoa. They're not being forced to do that because Tua Tagovailoa, your decision has to be made by April 23rd right? or else somebody else will take him. It's not that way with uh, Cam Newton.